What's up, guys? You're watching the 141 podcast right now, and this episode is brought to you as sponsored by Enlightenment Candles and Company. All your homemade candle needs, wax melts, anything you need, go to their Facebook page right now, Enlightenment Candles and Company. Let's go. Yo, what up? It's J Mo, episode 10, 141 podcast. Yeah, yeah, and we yeah, got yeah. the whole fucking crew with us. Uh -oh. yeah. Introduce yourself, fellas. Skirt, skirt, skirt. Who go first? Taco. Somebody go first. Taco, it's go first. Taco. Well, yeah. The one and only Taco. Yours truly. Nacho Supreme. Taco, Taco. Bed. Taco Bell. Don't say Supreme because that makes it, get, it feels a little racist. Okay. To I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Special I'm guest, sorry. Emmy Award winning Donovan Turley. That's me, man. That's and then me. Grammy nominated best Nickelodeon actor, Trucker Miller. Why'd you leave me out the documentary? He said, why'd you leave me out the documentary? Why'd you leave me out the documentary? Give my man the screen time. You know why? P. Diddy paid his hush money. I'm the one who put P. Diddy on that I was being serious. He said, yo, what the fuck? Hey, somebody get this man out of here. Yeah. I'm the one who put P. Diddy on that jet. Bro, could you imagine... Could you imagine running in your private jet away from the cops? <laughs> <laughs> like GTA? <laughs> bro, like straight GTA, bro. Trying to get did the five stars the, off you? Did you see the video of him pacing back and forth out front of the airport? Yes, bro. Like, I'm so, there's a, He's I'm like, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked. The no. dude's behind the corner, like over a bush recording him. And he goes, he goes... Yeah, Diddy. How's it feel? What are you going to do now, Diddy? <laughs> <laughs> What's your next move? Oh, my God. <laughs> you guys hear the, the conspiracy that they said that when he got raided, it was just they weren't actually raiding him. They were going in to delete all the evidence off the computers. <laughs> just what secretly. The, probably, like, we got to burn Pulled it. up 400 people deep to burn his <laughs> Yeah. Did you see his neighbor was like, yeah, you know what? It is weird. He brings busloads of children <laughs> into <it. laughs> He said something about it. He was like, he's like, my basketball go over the fence. I don't even go over there. I don't want to go. <laughs> about that feels off. I can't quite put my finger on it. Like, yo, dude. Bro, bro. Him and, uh, him and. It's like 13 me. basketballs over Diddy's fence. <laughs> he just don't want to go. It's like the fucking Pablo's Sandlot over here with like, the hey, dog. With the the Pablo, with the dog with Pablo's the running the show right now. He don't, he don't like the fact that we're talking shit on this man, Diddy. <laughs> Damn. Like, hey, I was at those parties. We That's did have Pablo? a good time. We Pablo, did have a great time. Pablo Diddy. <laughs> Pablo came over. <laughs> Pablo Combs. Pablo came over here. <laughs> Pulls off a Mission Impossible mask and <laughs> fucking Diddy. <laughs> it's a master of disguise. Oh, shit. <laughs> 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 Doodle, doodle. <laughs> be crazy if it was the dude from Master in Disguise inside of Pablo. That's why he's so retarded. Oh my uh, god, poor Pablo. Dude. Bro, you Still know what would be funny, Save bro? It. If they sent Chris Hansen over to Diddy's Island, bro, oh, yeah. <laughs> with like a camera crew. Bro. Come on, they're trying down. to find Diddy in the Chris woods Hansen. in the, like the jungle, bro. He brought pizza and a condom. <laughs> oh shit, he That's brought recording right. He brought pizza okay, and a yeah. condom and oh, said, fuck it. Yo, what is Pablo's doing? He was going to hey, get into the shit. Pablo's about to start trying to do his thing. I don't like Yo, he starts Pablo, He starts nibbling on. on my ear and starts getting real weird. Bro, I've watched Pablo fuck more grown men than... He's tried. <laughs> and then did he. <laughs> then did he. Yeah, dude. He's did fucking he, dude, did he. That dog a freak, bro. That dog is a freak. <laughs> uh, freak Mills. This is Pablo. <laughs> freak Mills. Can I pet that dog? Bro, why were they Can saying I pet that, that dog? Can I pet that dog? Bro, did, they, did you hear the audio clip of Diddy, supposedly Diddy? It's fucking clearly me just gay porn. It's so <laughs> just a screen oh, yeah. recording. Bro, of it's porn. so fried though, bro. <laughs> they post on Twitter. I got on Instagram and there was a world star fucking video of LeBron James saying, "Yeah, them Diddy parties are crazy." <laughs> 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 like, dude, calm down. Stick to basketball, brother. Chill. <laughs> Bro, could yep, you imagine? Yeah. What would you do? We're 
we're all artists sitting here right now. What are you yeah. going to do, bro, if you got a call from Rock Nation tomorrow and they were like, Diddy's looking at you and he's ready to sign <laughs> you. Fucked. You got to come to this party. <laughs> Get fucked. I swear to God, I would turn down... Bro. Three hundred million. Drop the pin. Right you got to let the heat Send die the down. Yeah, somebody <laughs> drop the pin. <laughs> somebody drop the pin. I'm drop the low. I'm on the way. <laughs> drop the low. Hey, I need this record deal. Damn. Drop the low. <laughs> well, you take I mean, it a blow for the dog. I'll never sell my soul, but I might sell my. Blow. You see that picture of <laughs> fucking <laughs> little baby with the two old ass white dudes like hugging up on him? At yeah, the from suit behind party. him, they're all smiling yeah, they're like, like a J C Penny ad. Like like a J C Penny ad. <laughs> look like a fragrance commercial. <laughs> look like fucking Christmas cards. <laughs> Merry Christmas from the family. Merry Christmas Merry down Christmas in Cabo. <laughs> Bro. That's so funny, dude. Oh, P. Diddley, man. <laughs> you get hit by the diddler, you're crazy. <laughs> it's you like fucking like diddler. CBD? Bro, I'll take a fucking take a C and a B and a D. C and a B and a D. I will, I'll take the. The D is Diddy. Diddy's like the last fucking boss. <laughs> Diddy, 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 Diddy do it. Diddy Diddy's the old blooded Diddy. Diddy's the last Diddy. boss fight dude, no, before Diddy you can get that record deal. Diddy is the new pause, bro. Diddy's the new pause. You didn't see that dude that was like, uh, I put these young men in position. No Diddy. No. <laughs> Brother, that is gold. No Diddy, though. No Diddy, no Diddy dog. No Diddy. <laughs> like, no homo. Jesus. No Diddy. I'm going to just start saying no hetero. I no full, we're going full. Fully brought full back that meme play. of the balls. <laughs> <laughs> what? It brought back that meme though. The dude walking the liquor store. He's like, "They got your man's on sex." Did you just remind me, <laughs> Tupac? <laughs> you just reminded me. Have you ever seen the video of the dude in like Kroger? At like the pharmacy or something, and he's singing, and he runs out of fucking air while he's singing in fall. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And he falls over. He blacks out because he couldn't sing anymore. Lost all his bro, air. You, oh my have God. you ever seen the video of the dude at the uh, gas station? He walks up and he's like. I'll give you $20 if you drink this whole Sprite and the crackhead tries to chug Throws this whole bottle of Sprite, bro. Bro, uh, fucking the dude that goes and gives fucking hot chip challenges to people in the hood is crazy. Oh, I've never seen that, bro. You've never seen that? No. Nope. Did you used to watch uh, like uh, Ed Bassmaster? Like Roman oh, yeah. Atwood? Yes, no, sure. Roman Atwood? Did you used to watch Roman, Roman Atwood? Atwood? Oh, yes. Yeah, dude. Bro, have you ever seen the video where he does the paintball prank in the hood? Where he like uh -uh. he runs out with like this paintball gun, bro, and it's empty, but he's acting like he's shooting people's car in the hood. And these two dudes jump out the car and chase him down the alley and jump some <laughs> fence and shit. <laughs> I used to love that shit or uh, Ed Bassmaster. Would you look at that, <laughs> bro? Like, would you look at that? Yeah, his classic videos. Oh my god, bro! Him, <laughs> he probably just had to look at it and say, "Old ass videos of him like prank calling people, bro." Oh, bro. bro so <laughs> fucking funny. The best. I remember when fucking Up Church was doing funny ass videos, bro. You that's what. That? That's he what. Was, bro. First time I heard about uh, uh, the Up Church uh, doing music, <laughs> I was like, "Bro, what are you guys talking about? Oh this god, guy's god, on my god, Facebook." Like, I watched that dude on Facebook religiously, and then he started doing music. Dane the like, Great is the go right now. He's a go. Who is it? Dane the Great. He's you know who guy. I really like? Hang on, let me think about it. Uh, it's the Duh guys. The Duh guys. Have you ever seen them? Uh -uh. They go up in Walmart. The dude, the he guys. went up in Walmart, and it's like it's like the kind of awkward shit I like, bro. He's like, walks up to Walmart, and he's like talking to interviewing the dude. He goes, uh, if you could only take one thing, deserted island for seven days. <laughs> this is and the dude goes, the dude goes, uh, I'd probably take a credit card. And the dude goes, you want to wash your ass? You want to take no soap? What? <laughs> Funky ass what? dude. And then he just walks away. I see so serious. I seen so dude, serious bro, these, I'm going to show it to you, bro. I've seen it's the a funniest dude shit of all time, bro. Carrier, carrying around a box on a college campus that was the size of a PlayStation 5 box. And the box did wind up being a PlayStation 5 box, but then it was just a blow up doll inside of the box. <laughs> it's like, you just want a PlayStation 5. And dude's like, why is the box so light? It's like, there's Bro. another box with a blow up bitch in it. <laughs> Have you ever watched Mr. Beast videos? Yes. Oh, fuck yeah. Bro, yeah. I love Mr. Beast videos. Bro, the, uh, would you do that kind of shit though? 
What do you mean? Like, like the sit in the chamber? You see the one where he had the chamber kid, for like, like two months or something? He, he had to do the most scariest shit of all time. He had to face every fear he had. And then he got like half a million dollars. Dude had to just fall into a pit of blackness and trust that there was something to catch him. I was like, you'd have got me there, bro. <laughs> you'd have got Mr. me on yeah. the first Mr. one, bro. Beast buried himself alive for like I know seven it's Mr. Beast for like seven days, days You think bro? he's going to let you fall, imagine, though? I, no, no, I don't. But let you imagine, fall. imagine Mr. Beast, Imagine if Mr. Beast is just done. He's head over water. He's all stressed out. Oh he's yeah, dude. And then he just <laughs> oh my god, he just bro. nothing He's there. Era. <laughs> <laughs> His origin story. <laughs> you guys ever seen uh, Fear Factor? Squid game challenge, bro. Too. Fear yeah. Factor is crazy, but I always oh, think yeah, about the Chappelle jigsaw puzzle. I always shout think about Rogies. the uh, uh, the Dave Chappelle Fear Factor, <laughs> dude. That is fucking hilarious. <laughs> Bro, the people on ass. Fear Factor were fucking real people too. Like those were real crazy. people and how they like acted and shit. Who? Someone just told that was me pure nineties. Someone just told me they went back and watched it and it was like hella sexualized. Or Probably. Something. Oh, I mean, it was two thousand. It was grown ups. Like, it was like Spike TV type shit. You know what I mean? They probably were definitely. <laughs> Did you guys ever see a thousand ways to die? Oh, dude, bro, I love that bro, show. I have oh some God. of the most fucked up bro. memories of my childhood because of that bro, show. Bro, for real, you fucking. Bro, I have fucked up uh, memories from watching The Faces of Death when I was little. Do you remember that shit? The Faces. People of would death. be like, I "Have you watched The Faces of Death?" I'm like, "The Death." No. And motherfuckers are like, "You ain't." Watch that shit, you pussy. Blah, blah, blah. It's like, basically Instagram I gotta go see now. What it was. It's all the yeah, I was like, videos. Like, and like, it's just your common fuck? Instagram on a Tuesday. Yeah, I was like, yo, this You shit. ever heard the uh, Immortal Technique song, Dancing with, with the, the Devil? devil. It's the only yeah. Immortal Technique song I know. Yeah, me too. But that's the most fucked up song I've ever heard in my life. Ever that's why I've never, I've never heard it. to another Immortal oh. Technique song in my life. <laughs> you, you, it's you, the you, most you, fucked up individual of all time, bro. Have you not heard it? Bro, it's a story about him. Have you not heard it? No. It's a Are very you serious. Is there a phone charger over there? No. I want to hear it, bro. It's an in-depth story so about. I play it. Oh, you're gonna play couch. it? No, I don't. Can we play? It? I don't even want to. Fuck I don't know. Uh, copyright. Uh, uh, copyright strike. Can't do that. I don't know if you want to hear that right now. No, but sure. I was. I was like, like eight, that bro? It's an in-depth bro. story about these guys that like it's this kid that he grows up he wants to join be in a gang, so he gets accepted. You know what I mean? So they they say if you want to be part of the gang, we gotta go snatch a bitch up. And we gotta kill her, basically. Damn, dog. What? Dude, he it, just said clip that's it. so aggressive. Don't clip it's that. Dude. So in depth that it turns out it's the kid's mom. After they already beat her, like pulled the put a cover over her head, rape her. Holy all this. shit! Uh, it's the kid's mom. So he jumps off the top of the building and kills himself, and then the other guys Fuck, kill man. the mom. And but it's a crazy, crazy Batman song. scene. Bro. It's like like it will give it will make every hair dude on your body stand up. Dude wrote a story. It's very very. That dude has Dance to have a mom. Mortal dude. technique, bro. You can't write that story. Yes, yeah, he's fun. immortal, bro. And Damn. at the end, I don't know if it's true, but he says, uh, "You better listen because the story that I'm telling is true." Because I was there with Billy Jacobs and I raped his mom too. Like it's not like it's a true story. He he's talking about. Dudes. He's talking I'm about like, his buddies. That's bro, could so you like imagine if your friend bro. wrote so, that song? So they like played him? <laughs> about your mom, bro. <laughs> no, like, immortal they, technique. They I'm immortally trying, trying to tell immortal like, technique. Kill you. Around That's at night for a woman and got it's bro. It's a crazy song. It's like one you don't play at a party because people will leave. Yeah, yeah bro. It definitely it's definitely such a fucked up song. Down. So fucked. Damn. Yeah, definitely not a song you talk about on a podcast. I was about to say that bring the whole yeah. pod down, dude. I can't My believe you have actually ever heard it though. Where'd no, you go that's from crazy. There? I've never it's heard deep. about that. It's deep. I went deep. My fault. <laughs> we'll play no, you're good. Pod. We gotta listen to it. Sorry, you good. just cut deep. Bro. We gotta have we, we gotta have deep, deep moments. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah. It's, all right. not. it's probably real not. shit. Probably, just listen to it on your own. Everybody time. cry right now. Listen to it later. It's all right. Everybody cry right now. <laughs> Everybody cry right now. Right now. Right now. One of the funniest stories. Nightmare. 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 One of the funniest stories we've talked about recently is about Julio Jake. <laughs> so they were playing this phone game or something. What was it again, Trey? <laughs> they it was like it was like uh like truth or drink or like like some or like dare like you had to do the dare and if not you had to take a shot type shit. You know what I'm uh, saying? Fried. Man, they dared him to what? <laughs> Dude. Gay shit. I did call it. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Duh. What? Duh. I swear to God, they dared Julio Jake to some gayness. What is this? <laughs> some gayness. Black room sponsored no, by Diddy? No, what is this? To run, <laughs> we told him to run around the neighborhood butt naked. But he didn't. He <laughs> really you all, they all got drunk in a room. That's what they're doing. Like, <laughs> they, <laughs> hold, yeah, hold, yeah, hold on. Yo, yeah, no, they're yeah, like, like you, they're like, they're like, yo. <laughs> was you guys getting Get naked. Listen, listen. Get naked. 
and run from us. <laughs> Dude, no. Okay, that's the most <laughs> sus thing you could dark. say when Dude, you're drinking with your the buddies. Thing you think bro. about yes. Trey your Whitley homies Combs. getting drunk. Oh, you guys shit. are all fucked up. You're like, yo, <laughs> get naked and run <laughs> from us. <laughs> no. No. That's the most no. no. That's the most no. P Diddy shit I've ever heard. Dude, Trey bro. Bro. Hey, did that. Trey is P Diddy, bro. P Diddy, Trey Diddy. Bro. Question. Yeah, <laughs> was there <laughs> females? <laughs> yeah, first of all, was there females? Yeah, that, that's, there? Was there females there? No. Yo, <laughs> dog, bro. That's what I'm saying, yo, Jake. Get naked and run from it, off wait, the fucking. Did he do it naked? He was naked. Do it? Nah. Off no. the boomba. He did it in his bar. That boomba gets you fucking so stupid. Boom-boo. That boomba. That boomba get you stupid. That boomba get you fucking drunk as fuck. Man's got wild and got naked and ran down the street, bro. Bro, that's crazy. Shout so everyone's like, Jack. bro, you should get... Oh, okay, never mind. That man's an absolute menace. <laughs> Shout out menace. to Julio Jake for being an absolute <laughs> menace. Dude, the, I just tried the, to the, hit the microphone. The, the pictures from the last podcast confused. are fucking hilarious. I don't know if you guys have checked them out, but they are fucking great. Dude, the best. Yeah, bro. Bro. Julio Jake's a fucking legend in the streets out here. You gotta get him back on. That. Bro, yeah, J-Mo, let me smack that vape ski, dude. Can I hit the vape? Oh, shit. Dude, I'm about to Anybody got any cool conspiracy theories that are new? New? I like aliens. <laughs> um, been is MGK. <laughs> I am MGK. Americans <laughs> don't exist. I am MGK. They're only Mexicans that live in tents. That's my conspiracy. <laughs> Yo. Native <laughs> Americans aren't real. <laughs> tell truck. Tell truck. Tell truck. I said Native Americans do not exist. They're only Mexicans that live in tents. <laughs> but don't. Call a Native American a tent Mexican because they don't agree with that conspiracy and Yo. they don't like it. Yeah, no, <laughs> bro, that's not. Jesus, that's so crazy. He said, I'm, that's crazy. I'm one eighth Navajo, bro. What do you? How dare you say that? <laughs> Just get the Native American <laughs> shell wild, shot. bro. Trey, how does that make you feel? He's eighty-five percent Apache. Wild, he just slugs bro. me. That's what you really. Feel? Bro, you do look like you're from a fucking tribe, bro. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Jim. Tribal. Yo, Jim. <laughs> That's how that. You look I tribal as that. fuck, I like my guy. My three part apology by saying <laughs> he's Samoan. My guy looks tribal bro. as fuck, dog. Dude. Hawaiian. That Samoan dance Hawaiian. you do at weddings is crazy. Bro, have you seen that, that shit at the yeah, pool? Yeah, bro. I do that. What's I do that. Shit? I do that shit at the what's, pool. What's that dance? Uh, a, a haka? Is that bro, we keep doing that. My bad. The, <laughs> scoot up. A haka loogie. <laughs> it's uh, a uh, well, I don't know what it's going to be. Something like that. I, I don't know. I'd like to begin my second three-part apology to the Native American people by saying... <laughs> haka loogie. That you aren't tent Mexicans. <laughs> what the fuck? There you go. <laughs> That's it. Bro, it wasn't so. Boy. That wasn't so bad. Was it? That wasn't so bad. <laughs> no, I'm right, just playing. No. I'm just playing. I'm just kidding. You slipped out of that. <laughs> Ow. What truck? What are you thinking about, Sad. dude? Dude, I'm trying to think of some. He's swole right Legendary now. Legendary something. It's coming. He's called my man Fat. He swole. Yo, chill, bro. Damn. It's waterway, bro. Cut him some slack. <laughs> Sw- <laughs> swelled up is a crazy word. He swe- swelled up is crazy yo, words. I just thought of that word. That is bro. fucking insane, yo. <laughs> what did he say? He said my man swole. I think he <laughs> swole. called my Fat. What, you call me fat, bro? No! Damn. Hey, you heard it from his lips. No. no. He said it. I just repeated it. <laughs> bro, I want to go get one of those fucking, uh, you seen the dudes, like fat dudes who get the the ab BBL? <laughs> <laughs> Beer belly and a yeah. fucking six Oh, pack. my God. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, yeah, a fucking dude. stencil and a spray tan. <laughs> yeah, dude. Contouring. <laughs> Adds depth. Oh my god, did you paint? <laughs> That's fucking great. You walk- Contouring the belly is insane. <laughs> if you woke up and painted on abs every day, it would be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> would it not, though? Could and you just, imagine yourself? And they just never somebody took does that. Somebody you does it. There's yeah, somebody out in the world that does out there. Yeah, what, bro. Paints on abs there. every day yeah, for Somebody sure. does oh, it. Absolutely. Shout out to all the ab painters. <laughs> all the dude out there. I don't know Shout if you're listening. Dudes, dude. I hope you're not listening. If you're an ab painter, dude, dude. Like, we want no smoke. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't like with your huge. I don't abs. want to be, bro. Fucking your, <laughs> synthetic, <laughs> synthetic abs. Bro. They're about it's as not people real, that paint. Bro. Trump right. definitely spray or spray tans a six pack on from time to time. You, oh got yeah, to. dude. Trump. He could probably yeah. get like the best one too. It looks yeah, so best. real. High definition, quality. high definition abs on Trump's body. His bareback, surgically implanted, shredded. Fucking, uh, uh, 
was the <laughs> Trump was, <laughs> if Trump was a genie, he'd come out the bottle of fucking spray tan lotion. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta rub it three well, times, bro. Three wishes. You fucking drop your You get three wishes. Dude, if you, drop- and you can't wish for more wishes. <laughs> I would never say that. That's what they said. That's what the genies told me. <laughs> yes. Dude, Trump looks like he got fucking dipped in fucking stain. I mean, it's dead, like the genie from some the wood stain. stain. <laughs> some, <That's fun. laughs> some wooden deck stain. It looks like you dipped him right He's in a nice some- mahogany. <laughs> bro. Bro. Nice cedar wood. <laughs> Dude, he looks like he's like sat in a smoky room for like 20 years. It <laughs> has got all it's orange. Quality craftsmanship. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, man. oh my God. He said he's a nice mahogany. <laughs> <laughs> he comes out a nice mahogany oh, color. <laughs> nice every mahogany. Time. Chestnut. Chestnut. Oh my Chestnut. Chestnut. Chestnut wood. Now we're he's Jr. really wearing a cedar cover. look today. <laughs> <laughs> Looking a little maple. What did, what did, uh, Looking a little maple today, huh? <laughs> maple. Soaking in orange juice. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> it looks like you fucking let Donald Trump ferment in orange juice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so tell me, though. Soy sauce. <laughs> tell me, though, dude. I love soy sauce, <laughs> but I don't love the Asians. <laughs> Too many Asians with the soy sauce. That's what I say. What would do your Donald Trump impression? <laughs> no, but that's hang on. Impre- that's my he's poor auditioning, attempt at auditioning. doing an, impre- an impression of Shane Gillis doing an impression of. Hey, Donald Shane Trump. Gillis gave out the soup though. He, he wants did. more people to do it. He said yeah. it's not hard to do. You should try. It. Yeah, you should try. It. You, you should, should definitely right, try. So, it. so Taco, give me an impression. Donald Trump auditioning for the role of Jack Sparrow. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> yes, you got I mean, it already. Right now. You got it already. You got it already. You're what up- do you mean? You threw out all the rum? <laughs> that was a lot of rum. I got here. I said, "Wow, that's a lot of rum." Know, bro. <laughs> oh my god, that's pretty good, though. But um, don't oh, worry, folks. I'll be here all week. Pretty good. Oh my god, dude. I'll take that. Bro, I cannot me. stop thinking about just. Taking a little tiny fucking miniature Trump and dipping it in mahogany stain. But what if tentacles? What if Trump had a mini me like Doctor <laughs> 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 Doctor Evil, Trump. bro. Dude, at the debates, lasers, that would be crazy. Man. At the debates, he just he sat up on the podium. Lasers. He sat up on the podium. <laughs> lasers, <laughs> lasers. <laughs> With the air quotes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Russia has lasers. You got Trump and Little Donnie for vice president. <laughs> Trump know. and Little Donnie. Dude, little Trump would be crazy. Little Trump. He looks like a little Clementine, a little bitty orange. <laughs> like a little gnome. A little gnome no, Trump. On a serious note, there's Trump's nobody team. cooler in politics than. Bro, he's throwing that ass back. <laughs> I don't like that shit. Who? What? There's nobody cooler in politics than Hunter Biden, bro. Bro, there's bro. nobody cooler. Think about this, bro. <laughs> Smoke crack You're not even almost. supposed to be there, and you're just allowed to. <laughs> Do cocaine all. wherever, bro. A true Around international the nervous pressure. <laughs> <laughs> you just go and take money from wherever you want. That's my Biden. Want. That's my Biden impersonation. A true true international nervous pressure. Have you ever seen the video where Biden? <laughs> true international nervous pressure. And Biden <laughs> flips the card and he's like, "This is what they told me to say." <laughs> <laughs> Bro, Mitch McConnell having a fucking seizure on the podium. He's just like rebooted. Damn. <laughs> Mitch is off the Fetty pack. <laughs> it's awesome. Yeah, a full blown <laughs> fentanyl <laughs> overdose on stage. They're like Mitch. Are you good? <laughs> Mitch? Are you good out there? Get what is happening? Empty can off and then other feet. countries are looking at us like. Yo. That's their leader. I don't even think other countries actually exist. What if that was the truth? <laughs> we were the <laughs> only but, thing. But yeah. what if, like, you're right, like, oh, okay, but I went at a country and I flew. The, what if you didn't? What if bro? you're the only person that exists? All the videos. How do you know I'm real? What if it's just one big Fuck fucking other countries? What if it's just you? All the videos from Ukraine Damn. are really Detroit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because like, I've never been there. Different. You know, like it. Jesus it might Christ. not be there. We just know the idea of other places, anymore. you know. Like Russia had their. I way. believe that there's got to be real life NPCs out in the world. There is. There's no way sure I see exists. so many robots? people. There, I see so many people on a day to day basis that I never see again. I know. I've met NPCs like 
Like for sure. Like bro. for sure. <laughs> NPCs. Like, like, just like I could walk right there. I knew a dude named Launchpad that was definitely an NPC. Oh, His name was Launchpad? My, all right, sort of Wait, is he? Did he no, listen, did he listen. Pass? He's sitting. No, I don't think he passed. Okay. <laughs> Surprisingly. He's NPCs sitting at the, never die. He's sitting data. at the table with me uh, one night, and he's <laughs> fucked up. He doesn't drink a pack of steel reserve. He was sprung. Yeah, he was oh, super yeah, sprung. Launch <laughs> pad was sprung. Two eleven. It's a big old. Yo, listen, though. Launch listen, pad he drank. Sprung? He had drank, like, six of the tall boy steel reserves. Shoot. The basically four locos, Yo, and he's missing an eye completely. Missing one eye completely. Call him Launchpad, and I'm like, "Yo, can you get me a plane?" It's like I can get you one right now. A Immediately plane. snaps back. I can get you a plane a right plane. now because they called him Launchpad. He used to drive planes or fly planes. I mean, supposedly. <laughs> yeah, supposedly. Supposedly. This, this is what he met, told we us. We met in the trap house. Yeah. He was off more than just For the two eleven. He was off that. way more than the two eleven. This boy was geeked. <laughs> Yikes, son. And I'm like, things. yo, can you give me a plane? Right? He's like, I got you right now. I got you, baby. <laughs> right now. I'll, like, how I'll would you do it? Come like, on. That's why they called him Launchpad, because he he apparently can fly anything. Yeah, fly whatever. Be military, flying helicopters or something. What? <laughs> I don't know. But no, definitely NPC, for sure. The way he's just like, I can get you a plane right now. <laughs> I can get you a plane. He's like the whatever mechanic off of GTA. Mean, but, oh, yeah. Where? Johnny on the like spot. I'll go. hook you up. I'm on the clock. What yeah. you need, boss? That whole, <laughs> <laughs> that whole fucking house was filled with full of crazy memories. Bro, that's so. what I think heaven is, bro. Man. I think I just spawn into like GTA like first person. Dude, can amazing. you imagine getting up Los to heaven Santos? and the gates are just always locked? Like you just can't get past the front gate. You got to stay in that little void of like seven like a strip feet. club at one it's just like, on a Monday. It's just like nothing. Just eternally walking towards a gate. No, not like no. You're just stuck in like a seven by seven foot square of like Bro, here's shit. the gates and they won't open. Nightmare, and then you nightmare, just have to nightmare, stick right nightmare, there. Nightmare. Like, what if it just said? What if it just said? Uh, uh, buy DLC to unlock. <laughs> <laughs> you buy DLC. Fifteen hundred coins. Fifteen hundred <laughs> coins, <laughs> coins to get in the door. You only got seven hundred. They're like, you gotta go down to hell for a while and stack up. <laughs> like, I didn't even know I was collecting coins. <laughs> you like, get your bread up and you can unlock the gates. You gotta go work another job in limbo just to make <laughs> enough money to buy the DLC. Yeah. You gotta get a forty-year mortgage on your key to him. And then as soon as you put it in. There's an error. Could not that's accept credit card what's information. Happen, There's so many things that delay you. <laughs> Just one after the other, getting in the gates of heaven. God's and there's like, just so many delays. Your credit's not good enough. Like, we gotta get like, you're, score, you're like, yeah, you're not out of seven oh one. We gotta get that credit score, man. Dude, so oh, and not to mention that family late. of four that you killed driving home blackout drunk <laughs> <laughs> on the interstate. Hey, that, that cold October of evening. Somebody died on the interstate. Hey. I'm not gonna say who, but somebody in this room, maybe or maybe not. Had something to do. I had nothing to with, do. I, okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's yeah, reaching. Okay. No, I'm not reaching. He's Listen. He's not reaching. Listen. No, no, no. He's not, no. He's not no. reaching, but he's exaggerating. No, not, a, not, not, not an interstate reaching. murder. On some accusations. But... No, not oh, an interstate bro. murder. Bro's gonna just, do this to me on camera. Just listen. No, it's on the internet. If you swerve now. your car, right, just a little bit. <laughs> if you swerve, then the bun behind you swerves a little bit. Then the one that behind them swerves a little bit. Then the <coughs> other ones behind them like die. Okay, Two hang, on, hang after. on. Okay, so look, I this feel man like is making it sound. You have somewhat on. to do look, with it. You're He's driving, reaching, right? You're buddy. driving. Whoa. You're driving. You're driving. You notice you probably you, you know, not uh, no. talking Listen, about you notice <laughs> no, it. Yeah. Right, Jordan? They didn't die. Oh, okay, bro. No, over here like, no they no. didn't die. He's exaggerating. Look, what happened? I'm like, like, yo, like, well, one time, bro, I come Me and him, we're in the car. <laughs> we're driving. <laughs> one time, bro, I went and slid. We're on the, we're oh, on, my God, no. <laughs> we're on one the time interstate. I went and slid I'm driving. On that ass. No, this was just a regular drive. And I happened to be over the white line a little bit. I'm not fucking in two lanes, but I'm over the line a little bit. happened to be So the person to the right of me swerves a little bit because I'm, you know what I mean? I'm over the line. He's Freddy Krueger. But they don't, I'm not talking, they, they just get over. You know what I mean? The person behind them does the same thing. Just, oh, he's over the line. Let me get over a little bit. Three cars back, this person 
loses their shit. Yeah, no, this is still like an action movie. Bro, so if it's behind goes, you, it's not your fault. Oh, no, yeah, no, it's not. If it's okay, behind you, let me it's clear. Gone. It's not Kyle's fault, but it's a cool, but I, it was, crazy story. It was definitely story. a chain reaction that started with me being a little over the white line. So, I mean, I'm <laughs> well, not completely not at fault. Dude, I'm not it completely it at fault. Sounds like you guys were off the white line, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus no Christ, bro. No, dude. Just, dude was throwing water that, balloons at that cars was a good one. Shield, bro. But no, so so this person behind her, you know, problem? few cars back, goes crazy. They fucking, I hear their tires. They go over three lanes this way, back over to where they were, like three different times, and then on the last one, boom, they hit that middle <laughs> wall, and they. Bro, all four tires off the ground. It was their tread, bro. The they air. didn't have enough they, tire tread, bro. I mean, yeah. they freaked. Not they saw the person in front of them swerve a little bit, and they freaked the fuck out and Tripping. completely Inexper- overcompensated. Inexperienced, bro. They don't know what they're doing. Yeah, they spent, but you know, it's not it, your. It, yeah, bro, bro, they they went airborne, landed on the side of the vehicle. Well, and like, <laughs> like it literally looked like the, the but look, bro. Fast and Furious yeah, were bro, videos. Listen, bro. listen, bro. no, no, it literally looked like like any scene, like start scene or like a uh, uh, pilot. It to a Bollywood, and I, it was I lose crazy. Sleep over this thinking about this shit. But at the end of the day, I can't. It, there's been several times I've been a little over the white line, and never before, other than that time, has someone spazzed out like that. And <laughs> it's clearly a woman driving. And we're com- well, come on. Oh next. my god. <laughs> hey, I thought it was funny. You said okay, it. comedy. Right, fuck you, you said guys. It. Yeah. No, there was in. Uh, thank God there was a police officer literally right there. They immediately flipped their lights on. That's what was crazy. Yeah, there was a fucking. So they immediately got help. Damn. So but the whole got, but rest of the trip to the Redneck yes. Rave was ruined. Like the it was, it was all, already. Ruined. It was a bad v- fucking. My car on the way to the rave. My my transmission blew. What yeah. year? The, two. I don't know. Five. Oh, four years 18, ago. Nineteen. Something like that. Yeah. Years back, that was a four big or five years ago. For us, Bob. But, <laughs> no, the, my, my transmission blew out on the way to the Redneck Rave, so we had to. We couldn't rent a car for some reason. Or no, I think we could have, but we thought we saw 1995 for a U-Haul truck for the day. We're like, that's got to be cheaper than renting a car. No, it is not, especially if you're going a state o- over, because then they charge an out-of-state fee. So hard. They pay you for all the miles you drive. We ended up spending like <laughs> three, four hundred dollars for. 24 hours, I think, yeah. 48 hours. Yeah. It was crazy. Not good. But so already my car fucks up. Now we're driving this fucking U-Haul that I already spent a shit ton of money on. So now I'm broke. And <laughs> and then this happens. So I've just got this on my conscience the whole way. Like, oh, I hope there wasn't a fucking kid in that car. Bro, I hope, like, oh, oh, shit, yeah. bro. Well, did you ever stop they and think about right. instead of a U-Haul, like they trying right. to tame a wild horse? <laughs> Dude, if we, yeah, bro. if we did all like just go straight to Mamo- Metamora or whatever on horses would be crazy, would have been bro. insane, bro. <laughs> that would have been, been insane. insane. I mean, that's redneck rave. Y'all ever down been to Anderson? At its finest. Anderson? Anderson? Yeah. I live like bro. 20 minutes from Anderson. Where you live? Muncie. Oh, okay, right on. What's up, family? Dude, Anderson. What's up, family? I mean, yeah, it's your boy <laughs> uh, Tabasco Sweet here. <laughs> 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 What's up, family? Bro, oh, was, oh was, yeah, that with the the Supreme. Oh, Tabasco sweet. I forgot about it. Hey, that, you know dude. who's Shout gas? Tabasco sweet. You watch Churdley's, right? Churdley's? No, Churdley's. Yeah. Are we serious? The, I'd have to. You, bro, is is the you would know it if you see it. Bro, Churdley's. He does a lot of videos with Travis or Travis Trevor Wallace. Trevor Wallace. Yeah, yeah T Wall, yeah. bro. Trevor you definitely Wallace. know Churdley's. T Wall, dog. What are we at? What time are we at? We're cooking. Trevor cooking baby. Trevor Wallace. Six hours. Yeah. Shout out T Wall, bro. Trevor Wallace. He's listening. Hilarious. I know he's tuning in. He just opened up for uh, Tom Segura and Burt Kreischer. It was, he opened, Bob, it went him, then Bobby Lee, then Shane Gillis, then Tom Segura and Burt Kreischer in Las Vegas uh, like a month ago. For did their, you see uh, Joey Diaz just came out at the mothership and fucking did, I did a set? I did not, but I just watched his, I'm in the middle of watching his Joe Rogan podcast. We were just listening did to that on the way here. Did you see... Violent J? <laughs> Violent J on Guilty. On your mom's house? Or on Kill no, Tony. I, didn't Kill Tony. I did not see that, but I saw him talk about it. Now that I know that he wasn't prepared, or he didn't know. I yeah, feel he said better. that they like. He, nah. said, he, he thought he was just there to like just watch and just be like chill. at the table, and they're like, "All right, you're going on stage to do 60 seconds." 
Dude, Get he ready. did like four and a half minutes. Yeah, he said he was like, I've done stand I don't eat ass. Before, so he's like, I figured I'd just give I don't him a eat shot. ass. I don't eat ass. I think he said that someone wrote him a couple jokes and he was like, nah, I'm just going to wing it. <laughs> respect. He just yeah, that's went, crazy. In front yeah, of like three he sounded like real. He sounded like fucking Macho Man Ready Savage and he was like, and you know, bro, <laughs> the, the, <laughs> I've never put my dick in an ass. <laughs> <laughs> Violent J sounds like fucking <laughs> Randy Savage. Sounds like Randy justifiably in a sounds like the I'd ultimate warrior. Yeah, he said, that was a horrible. He said, man. "Y'all never <laughs> fucked with the Juggalos." <laughs> Juggalos. <laughs> Juggalos. So what's it matter anyway? <laughs> that was Bro, so hey, funny. Speaking of Juggalos, I just saw a video Chris Palmore shared of his. He said he went viral for Speaking it a while ago. He did go viral for it. He it did go him viral. At the, I think at the gathering, yeah. he was talking about, he was, someone was doing an interview he with him. This made me laugh, so I did not expect this. He said, my homie died, and he said he got cremated, and he said one of his final wishes was to have his ashes put into a Fago bottle and launched at the gathering. And he said, but, uh, I don't know if you know this, but human ashes, when put into Fago, Act like Diet Coke and Mentos. <laughs> and he just Bro. left it at that. Bro, Chris Palmer yeah. is one of the most fried. That's bad. Hilarious. So get this. I meet them. I meet them about last year. I uh, when I started working at Canes, I met them, right? But we get put on the same festival. There's a there's a festival, some random indie dudes are putting yeah. on some right. We go to this festival, right? And it turns out to be a big blowout. No one's fucking coming. No one came, nothing. Uh-huh. So we all spend all this money on merch. And there's okay, so it's this Christian kid. Yeah. It's this Christian guitar player, acoustic guitar people, sex waffles, and uh, me and my brother Chris. That's all the merch and shit. <laughs> Christian guitar player, and then the sex waffles. Right, right. Yeah. So hang on, bro. It's a lineup. Chris it's Palmore, the, the kid goes up on stage. We've all been talking anyway. Like everyone's hanging out, and like yeah. uh, uh, the dude kills it. So everyone's like giving him, oh, bro, we like that. We like that. Chris Palmore's like, hey man, I would love to trade you CD for CD. And his girl stands up and she goes, we would never. (laughs) She says, that is so offensive and disgusting. God has got so much shit coming for you. Wow. (laughs) The most fried shit ever. But hang on. Tell me this. 15 minutes later, I walk back up to the table and they had like a vape shop come out and set up a booth. Bro, this dude, Chris, went over there and bought a whole can of nitrous bro and he's fucking doing whippets right <laughs> next to these Jesus people bro and he's right by these Jesus people yeah bro, Shout out bro that's Chris crazy Palmore, bro. that oh, is yeah. goat shit that is so, so funny. Funny. the funniest motherfucker that's bro so Fuck funny him. he was just like well, they don't like the sex war. <laughs> <laughs> the deep boys. <laughs> oh my God. Well, oh, they don't like the sex <laughs> God is good all the time. Uh, bro, and shout out, time shout out that good. dude, bro. They didn't pay none of us, oh, bro. Man. We were on contract from Chris me. Palmore being on Christian Mingle. Bro, that crazy. kid was from like North Carolina or something. I hit him up and I was like, bro, let me mix some of your shit or whatnot and he was like no offense bro <laughs> I was like bro I was like bro he was no like, offense bro cause, but cause me and Chris's shit is God does saving. not approve of that's your mix, crazy bro. no he no well, offense, but you are going straight to hell yeah that's pretty much what he was like There's cause no me and Chris we do music ever. save me right but it's not nothing religious it's not about that yeah but he took it as like we cuss and we're trying to talk about God. So I didn't say nothing about God, bro. What are you talking about? They take it to heart, bro. Bro, they take it so I'm to heart. I'm telling you right but now. But his, his girl and my mom start arguing, right? And they're like talking about God because my mom like stood up for Chris. Where my mom's killer, bro. She's funny as hell. But she starts arguing and she goes, and this is his wife talking, right? This dude's wife. Yeah. She's like, well, God saved me. I was a sex addict. And all I used to do was love to cheat on my husband. I just <laughs> Oh, yeah. why are they all like that? Bro. That's so realistic. Bro, and I'm, like, and I'm like, you're I talking don't about men's no more. You're talking about because I told you to shake your ass. I'm I don't love men's no more. I'm straight now. I'm, I'm delivered. Straight. I am delivered. I don't like men's no more. <laughs> <laughs> I am straight as an arrow now. Bro, why do they do that? Why do they do so Why do they get so fucking, like, hit? That's up why I hate I'm telling you, no, bro. Like, the whole... Dude, I, 
be you know what I mean, believe in whatever fuck. Right, no, I'm believe in whatever fuck. Bro. But the church shit, bro, I did that shit my whole life. That shit is fucking whack, bro. I can't even get into it now. Sometimes I'm telling you right now, I go oh, to church right now. I'm walking out as a Bob Hickman 2.0. <laughs> Yo, you you know Bob Hickman? No, not at all. None of y'all know Bobby but Hickman. God entered crazy. my body as a body, same size. Shout out Bob Hickman. Yeah, look Shut him up. up. He's like an international phenomenon. He really is. Hundreds of thousands of views. He's from Indianapolis. I see him all the time. We have got to get, bro. Have you ever this seen set the up dude? on the podcast where we can pull up videos and have him like play? Have you, like that would be perfect to pull up a Bryce. Bob Hickman right now. Have yeah, you Bryce seen the dude sleeper. in Indianapolis that does content and he like went to? He was like, "This is the." Uh, uh, worst rated Chick Fil A in Indianapolis. The get the scariest one, the most it was like dangerous. a fucking Yelp, a Yelp reviewer. Yeah, I literally no, just bro. Took the words out of my mouth. No, he's funny. You ain't ever seen him like playing a basketball, bro. And he's like, I don't want to be disrespectful, but he looks crazy as hell. Man, I gotta find it. And Bob I Hickman. It. Bob Hickman is like convinced that like God entered his body and fucked him or something and fucking he like posts. It's the craziest, most sexual Christian shit. He posts like the same video every day. It'll be and I him met him in person. He's in fucking basement. psycho in person too. It's, I, w- we, I wish we could pull it up. Oh my god, it doesn't hit <laughs> right without being able to show you guys. Look up Swear anyone god. listening to this podcast. Just get on YouTube. Look up Bob, Bob Hickman. Hickman. If you, Bob see, if you Hickman. see a white guy with a bowl cut, but his bangs look like That's he it. combed it, and he looks like a barcode. It's very just thin. You know who I'm talking about? Jesus. Oh. Jesus <laughs> Christ! But it looks like a barcode. It's just straight lines that you. Oh, it's so funny! And All now, of these videos are titled "God Entered My Body as a Body Same Size." It'll be him, like me, floating into you, or you back to the camera in mean? his underwear. I don't He's know, like rocking dude. back and forth. That's why he opens every Speaking video. Scripture. With. It's. It, bro, have you ever it, seen the dude? I can't think of his what? name. He's but he my gets, God. He uh, is my he, bro, he's, he's from my Indianapolis. Savior. His whole van is painted and it says "Fucking God Entered His yeah, Body" all over his van. Green van driving around with white paint all over it. It's just the word God entered He's my body is a body YouTube. same size. God entered Every my body video, is a body same size. 200,000 views. It's insane. He's written like seven books in like multiple different languages. Bro. It, at the library. He is a full-blown enigma. I, it's like. What? There are famous YouTubers that have done like what's up with this guy kind of like deep bro. dive like creepy. Bro. It was so easy to meet bro that I just knew he was going to be at the library one day. He's always over there. I fucking pulled up on him. Came right up to him and got a picture with him. Did I not? Yeah, you you Facetimed me. You're like, bro, look just, who this is. He, he's Bobby like, I'm in the library. You're never gonna believe who this is. Oh no, he Facetimed me and van. showed me the van. That's what I've it was. And I was outside. like, I was no like, that's the dude way. That's <laughs> just ran into, bro. And then I had a picture. With we got to get him on the pod. Gotta get we got to so get him on the pod. Fun, we so absolutely fun. have to watch one of or two of his videos after this and get Bob Hickman on the pod. Because we're gonna need like a fucking. I want to pick his brain. Have you ever seen the dude who gets like old MREs and shit when they have <laughs> cigarettes and like he smokes like the old cigarettes? What? You can't give him the Addy. What? What'd Sorry, what you say? My bad. Have you ever seen the dude who like uh, gets old MREs and shit and like smokes the old ass cigarettes that came inside of him, bro? Is that the military rations? Yeah, you know what bro. MREs are? Oh. Bro, and like they, Would you they ever used eat one? to like. They're Not like 50 old years old, bro, and he smokes the Kyle, camel, bro. dude, you just reminded me of Kyle wanting to do uh, the fucking shirt like streaming or whatever. Kyle, you bring up bad stories. Oh, I don't like it. <laughs> when Taco wants to eat the Surstrom or whatever, Surstrom is. So I was going to say that Surstrom. like 10 minutes ago. I want to buy a can of Surstrom and eat it all the time. <laughs> the fuck you're is fucking that? foul. I don't even know. What is it? You're what foul. Is that? Why does everybody know what? You're foul. Did I, do That's I not have that no, language unlocked? Bro, you ain't seen it on TikTok? Bro, sounded like a Sims to rice. What is it? Hell, What is it? Can of fermented fish. You've seen the TikTok. No. As soon as they crack the can, they start fucking bro. nasty. Yo. Up. It's <laughs> supposed to be the nastiest, but it got so popular that the cans are like a hundred something dollars. Actually, I don't even know if you bro, can get them anymore because they said that like after this, we're done. You open the can and you throw. But if you go viral, you get the can. Bro, when you they were the pulling video, out the fish, viral. when they it's pulled out slimy. the fish, I can't just slime and bone. Stop. People start throwing Stop. up. Stop. <laughs> People throw up Stop. as soon as you crack yeah. the can open. That's how strong the smell is. Who eats it? It's it's Liver King. It's in like a. It's in like Sweden or something. It's. I mean, it's bro, like a. They get down and they love it, bro. Let they me go it. to Sweden. That's bro, delicacy. And you walk up. That's to fucked with, up. With, uh, Schwarzenberg. Schwarzenberg. Shimmy Shuri or whatever you say. <laughs> But yeah, I, I want to. Bad. I want to get just for... It would be so funny. 
Because like I did the hot chip challenge just because like, oh, there's a camera. I Content? Okay, let's go. He oh, made man. it through that. Bro, I watched Rex though. Wolf, bro, when we were at this, we were at the, you were yeah, at the Yeah, yeah, you did uh, Hot Boys. He the did the Hot, hot Boys, Boys show, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Listen to this, bro. No, Listen to this, bro. Boys. Brian oh, Foster's oh, okay. on the camera. Brian you Foster's just boys? walking around on the camera. And uh, uh, Rex was like, walked up on my chicken. Like I was just eating some normal shit. And he was like, that's that hot shit. I'll eat it right now. I was like, no, you won't. He was like, yeah, I will. And Brian got on camera. I was like, all right, wait right here, bro. I went out. We went and bought one, bro. He the ate, hot one, the atomic the, the, or whatever. The, 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 the hottest crazy, one. The hottest one, bro. The hottest like a one. Challenge. Bro, this dude and ate it whole, in that's four whole bites. Chicken. That's bro. not even a chip. Four bites. Like one little chip. Then they got. Then they bought three more. They bought three more bro. and had three people. And all three people like fucking had to leave. Type shit. I oh. think no way. So Jamie did it, and then uh, I would never do uh, that shit, BK bro. did it, and then mild. some other. I would never do that shit. Hey, yeah. shout out to fucking hot boys though. Yeah, that shit fire. Fire. Was, I had my, my birthday there last year. So really? fire. Who, fire. Who was the other person that did it? Who all was it? Who all did it? Some other guy did it and he threw up later. Wow. It's on the it's on the recap. Some other guy. Oh that and throwing up hot, who it was. hot shit. All the heartburn and shit. Oh, that's bro. worse than Crazy going down. Now you got you, stomach brother. acid. Oh, I would never do that shit, bro. Bro, bro, be bro this shit stunk so Rex, bad. Dude, Rex, it's going to be piled yeah. through that shit, though. Rex he said did. when he got home, yeah, his stomach was fucked up. It was, about it was hot. Like it was like died. stupid hot. Was, yeah, you died, bro. it's bro. stupid hot, bro. It's like it's fucking probably hot. like it's the, it's Carolina the Reaper. Strip challenge. I know it's his asshole was on fire, bro. Yeah. Dust. Dude, no, you're bro, telling me it's, it smells like it literally oh, it smells, smells like, death. like your nose hairs death. are burning. It smells, it smells like smells death in a fiery asshole. Set this couch on fire. That's foul, bro. Set this When I did that chip, I went to shit in lava. Five minutes with no food or drink, and then I smashed. Smashed a loaf of bread, chugged a thing of water, went to my car, and went to sleep. Bro, he went slept to for like sleep 20 minutes. Shit. Went for like sleep for like 20, 25 minutes, woke up and was like, hey, I feel like a fucking million bucks. He's I like, I need- great. It was like, it's bro, awesome. shit. He really did. He got right back up. Like I would have got some zombie. milk, bro. Bought some milk at least. No, that like shit curdled, bro. bro. Yeah. Oh, I was just, oh God, yeah. I was telling Prada on episode nine, <laughs> I think it was, curdled. about you eating that Girdle. super hot homemade salsa I made or homemade sauce. Mm. The peppers all in the blender. The and you just shit. went on the cheese roll ups. Roll-ups. I was like, dude, it's hot, hot, bro. He he went full force into it. I'm yeah, telling you, like that shit the right there, the bro, I just took a bunch of fucking crazy shit from the Mexican market. All the hottest, hottest <laughs> just shit blended they had. it all. <laughs> blended it in with oil and water, salt, <laughs> and shit. <laughs> and just put it on some street tacos, bro. Kyle put it on cheese You like that hot sauce, baby? Put way too no, much. Yeah, up. I didn't expect that it shit, to be that hot. That shit, I fucked, fucked up. you up, bro. What kind of shit did you put on it? Like, it squirts. He just mixed it. Yeah, I just... <laughs> on a cheese roll like it was like mild sauce from Taco Bell I mean you you cover some shit in some mild sauce right, from Taco right. Bell it so was I was like shit. fucking bring it on and Mm. <laughs> Regretted that shit. He had a ten year old put hot sauce in his vape before, and it was. You crazy. told him to do it. Yo, I was bro. asleep, and I used to have one of those drip <laughs> mod vapes. You I, know I mean? told him to drip the. How did that go? Sauce in the so drip. That's fucking. Have you ever seen the Luckily video I of the dude before I got a real oh vape? Have Deep. you ever seen that video of the dude who vapes the Carolina Reaper? Vapes the Carolina Rebirth. Look at this, bro. Like oh, that's <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Andy takes a bong rip. Bro. That's oh, what yeah. I was about to say. How much money would it take for you to take a bong rip of a fucking Carolina, Carolina Reaper, dude? You remember that GoFundMe we set up? Yeah, uh, fat uh, You remember that GoFundMe we set up? I need a million set up dollars. GoFundMe buddy. one time. I was like, if we get someone to donate five thousand dollars, five said, grand, I'll donate half of it. We really to, shut this up to, to breast cancer dude. charity for my mom. And I'll dab you're a cat smoking turd. a Carolina Reaper. Did nah, you just bro. say you'll dab a cat turd? That's exactly what I said. But Swear I to God. God. No. no. Up on it. Yeah. And I was like, if they do, that's $5,000 for charity and views, bro. That's content. Bro. Fuck it. I'll take pneumonia for a month. He really oh, did, bro. Can't. Listen, we set up a GoFundMe for Kyle to eat cat shit, and it was crazy. No, it no to, to dab a cat turd. Dab, dab it. Dab it. To take a to <laughs> to dab it. cat turd. <laughs> dab what it. What the fuck? Collector hit it. I How said, many, if we get $5,000 on this GoFundMe. It. I'll take one dab off a cat. How far did you get? Because I knew we got like 150 bucks. <laughs> so we sent it all back. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, 
Oh my god! I was. Please hey, don't donate. Please I know you were scared please though. Don't. But it was like. I, Could you imagine you got I had done it, it was, it, was, <laughs> it was. It was like around the time it was a certain a certain anniversary. <laughs> I don't remember how many years. years. He's just like. But yeah. my grandma had, had, had died from breast cancer, and it was like right around the time when the anniversary of her death had happened. So I was like, I, I'll fucking do. It. I know I'm trying to justify my. I yeah, what the fuck, bro? Really my was. grandma died, <laughs> Nana. I'm finna smoke yeah. his cash. Hey, this one's for you, Nana. This for all the tits. That shit don't add up. Oh my God. It's good though. For like five thousand dollars, she's gonna do anything for any kind of awareness of anything. That cost of, of anything. It's a <laughs> drop in the bucket. That's for, the cost of one bottle seen of the, pills. Uh, uh, <laughs> the most expensive is where they fucking the the coffee's yeah, the cat. Most turds. expensive cat turd. What? No, the coffee's like made out of like yeah, cat turds bro. from the jungle. I seen some no. <laughs> like what the the, the cats eat some, the coffee they eat beans. The beans. Hey, I tell you shit what, around here and then they we leave it shit in the coffee. toilet. Okay. Dude. After the poop, <laughs> after they don't the want. No, they don't want it before the poop. It's shit. after the yeah, poop. Yeah, dude. Shit. You drinking I'm, that coffee? They poop. go after their fucking poo and poop. Uh, it's like the Austin Powers thing. Little, Basil, this coffee tastes poop. like shit. This, <laughs> Basil, this shit, Austin. <laughs> yeah, it is shit, Austin. It's <laughs> exactly dude. what it is. No, you, really. Have you seen the people that like? I didn't know. Like you know, there's a <laughs> annual dog show every year on TV or whatever. Yeah, there's cat shows. Where they just hold them up like they're fake. Like, the, have you seen them? They're just like yes. They like stretch them out and fucking. Now those people are NPCs, oh, yeah, bro. Like a slinky, and the cat just, having cats just they're holding out. them out. Like, dude, if I did that to my cat, you my know cat what would fucking really bite is me. NPC activity. I saw last year. I saw a fucking uh, figure eight derby like at a rodeo. <laughs> like, and I was like, what? bro. I was like, this does not exist in real life. All the I people know, like were like up. fake. They're all like standing they're up dope. and ah. Shout out Sit to Demolition Derbies. Kyle Shout out. Tractor pulls. Taco's tractor dad tried pulls. to kill him one time in a plane. In a plane? Yeah. Yeah, my dad was a pilot, and I flew in the plane with him a couple times. He was His dad was cool. a millionaire. You ever seen this shit at the like Anderson one of, Speedway? One of the hundred times I spent with my dad <laughs> was in a plane. <laughs> and he shut the engine off on him. No, he, he was a pilot. No, listen. <laughs> he was getting his Swear pilot's license. So one thing they have to do is practice stalling the plane. So you know what to do if the plane stalls. So that requires turning the plane off and it starts to free fall and That's then you scary. start it back up. Fuck it's you. like three seconds. You know, you're just like, but it's that, you know, when you go down a hill in a car and you feel your nuts go in your stomach. It's that times it's 10, that, bro. It's like oh, the drop shit. zone. It's like oh, you're all right no. in the drop zone at Kings. You just start falling out And of then the you sky. just have to, and then uh, uh, dad, uh, fucking start the plane, please. Yeah. Let's operate a plane on a fucking, dude. on one of them slingshot things. Like, that's what it's going to feel like, dude. They <laughs> rode that. No, I didn't ride the slingshot. I rode that Superman thing one oh time. God, Fuck bro, that. I would have a panic attack. I rode that, that too. Would you skydive? I would yes. On my no. List, you yes, bro. I, so I would, yeah, skydiving yeah. sounds. But so I'm fun. gonna wait. Like if I feel like if I feel like my time coming, then I'm skydiving. Would you like yours? go down in one of those submarines that goes like three, four thousand? No. The, 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 the Titan. The Titan. Like two? the ball thing. Ooh. Like they Titan just, two. Yeah, they just fall. No, down. first of all, bro, Titan that is two. my biggest fear of all time. Is the it's time ocean. they're controlling it with a real Xbox controller. We only Implosion. know like what we only know like what like not even half, not even half, like thirty percent. The ocean is the scariest thing. Oh yeah, that's the scariest shit of all time. You, that you go down far enough, the fish has got light bulbs on their head. I'm like, bro, what are you talking? Yeah, about? Really taking the words what out the of my fuck mouth. is that shit? What is that? When you bro? get into the black and ang water, angler fish, like, he just scripted like, Nemo. Even in fire, we say even the scene is like a real thing, bro. Oh yeah, I know. Nemo where they swim down into the black. That gives me chills to this day. That's it. Yes, bro. No, Do you see the teeth on those things? Life, think bro. about that shit in real life, bro. Ooh. If, bro, if I was in hand. a submarine 10 feet underneath the water and I saw any kind of big fish, I would fucking piss myself, bro. That's like, what I'm saying, bro. Like a big like, ass, I, bro, like a big ass whale. Bro, that would be cool. If I'm, I'm on the beach, no, let me put fuck. it in perspective, bro. If I'm, I'm in a if boat. I'm on the beach and it goes <laughs> above my waist, like I'm not going above my my shit type <laughs> shit, bro. Like, oh, yeah. I'll barely dip my balls in at the beach, bro. Is what I'm saying. Like, I'm I've not, been in the I'm ocean one time, there, and that was yeah, I did. half of my feet. It was no socks, and I let the waves touch my feet. I Only like, way I get the in the ocean, bro, out. is when oh, it looks like dude, I went blue. out. You can see right through it. No, That's I don't the, care, bro. Stepping on jellyfish. I shit, swam bro. out. Bro, them jellyfish. I swam crazy, out. Man. I swam out until I couldn't feel no more. And then I was like, all right, I'm going to keep going. And then oh, it got no, sketchy. I, yeah, bro. Because then it just drops off, bro. It just drops off. I don't know how deep it is. Who knows how deep it is? I went parasailing, bro. Nope. And they take you nope. out. 
They nope. take you out far. Fuck. No. They nope. take you out Fuck. far, bro. No, dude. Bro, no, it gets to the point no, where the no. water is just black. It's I would just never black do that. water, bro. Uh, that and it's the ocean it, and it's waves, bro. That's fucked up. Bro, they just take you on the boat and dip you. They'll slow down and you slowly fall and you just dip in this black water, bro. That was the scariest thing of my life, bro. bro I bet, dude. Out in the deep ocean, bro. Have you ever seen those uh, new? I didn't like, even want to look in the water. Things that they like. No, so the I didn't know. Go, yeah, the I dolphins. damn near would ride. Bro, I one would of do those, that. Though. I would. Bro, that that shit. looks so good. Because it's in a boat. That's a little different. What? The it's it, they're shaped like a dolphin. It's like a submersed. It's kind of like a jet ski boat kind of thing, but it dives under the water. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. And, like, I would never boats. do that. I would do that. Oh, that yeah. sounds. I would do that. I would do, bro, you'd bro, be protected. You'd be like, fast. I would do that on Boom, Lake and Michigan. You dive into the water and then you and just hit some, or you, or you just dive in the water and there's a fucking shark. He wouldn't bro, try right to eat, bro. Whale? You'd be too fast, bro. Right in a whale's mouth. You'd fucking, you you'd probably home, fucking. Bro. <laughs> oh, my God, man. <laughs> bro, you just <laughs> fly into the fucking shark's mouth and then eject out of the bro. sea, bro, and blow him up. Be all right. Bro, what would it be like? Imagine. <laughs> like, you just what? end up with a pot of dolphins. <laughs> That's practically. <laughs> they save you. you. Bro, yeah, you get saved you by a fucking, of fucking dolphins. <laughs> you get saved by dolphins. How do you even. Uh, Aquaman is, pulls up. and die that yeah. way, bro? Like, you just go into a whale's stomach and then what? How, what bro, kills you, bro? Just imagine Ram dead my ass, head though. into a tooth and kill myself as quick as oh, I can. Boy. I can't imagine That's being out and just in you the wouldn't try to like of the ocean. you wouldn't try to like stab it. We well, can go through a whole a whale? whale, bro. <laughs> a whale? What about bro, you don't think you try to spit you out because you're stabbing him? Dude, you know what? what? You're not gonna stab a whale to death, Trey. Right? A whale? That's like we're talking like. It's like wall, like, like what he probably is like, hey, what he's probably like, like, hey, what are you doing in there? What if you go in the whale and then you said they're going fucking crazy? And he's like, hey, what are you doing in there, bro? Trent. He said, "What are you doing? You tickling my throat? What are you doing, dude? Stop!" Trey's over here trying to epipen a well. <laughs> you think he's just gonna cough and spit you out or something? He's like, Ugh, yeah, you just start tickling his throat, fucking cough. Moby prick. Moby prick. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. Oh man. Bro, nice. you could not- my, my phobia of water is like oceans and shit is so deep. That me and J Mo, we tried playing the game Subnautica. You know what that is? No. Nope. Nope. It's it's you're on an alien planet where it's all water. And oh, the whole dude. game, it's a survival game where you're, you know, collecting resources and doing this. You have to craft your base, whatever. But it's all underwater. And there's creepy, weird alien nope. fish. Really? And you're hearing like the weird <laughs> noises. Like I can't go on a cruise, bro. It, no, I, I would never play go that. Was sitting next to J-Mo. I would never. And then I see the video where they go, they go on a cruise and then they're swirling the side, like off the side. Of the I could ship, not bro. go on a cruise, bro. Bro, bro why would you go on a cruise? Bro, why would you do that? Lit, bro. I could why would you do cruise, that, bro? What are you wouldn't? It's just a big floating just, hotel. It's a big floating bubble. What are you why talking would, about, bro? That floating hotel. It doesn't even make sense. It's a floating hotel. Look at the ocean for miles, bro. That's why I don't believe it. It doesn't even make sense. You'd be all right. I'll stay in a stationary hotel. hotel. You'll be all right. And there's nothing. Have on you the seen beach. videos of ships have so many cruise ships now, bro. Yeah, and you know how that's what I'm saying, though. Like, what if a year? storm just happens, bro, out on the ocean? And then bro, bro, why? How is you know, you know how you don't die floating. in the ocean? You don't go in the ocean. Sharks can't get me if I'm on a couch. Well, it's floating because there's that <laughs> with much freaking ocean. lasers. <laughs> oh yeah, unless they lasers. have freaking lasers on their freaking, freaking lasers, dude. Lasers. Oh my god! Sharks with freaking lasers. The ocean's scary, scary, bro. Bro. How is there that big of shit? Like whales could grow that big. Okay, well, back in the day there was big. We haven't even seen half of it, bro. No, that's what I'm saying. We don't even know. What if there's like a whole nother? You think you think there's like mermaids and shit, bro? There's a documentary. Probably there's a documentary called like Atlantis. I don't know. There's like Atlantis. Called Welcome to Earth with Will Smith. So good. Such a good fucking documentary, bro. They go down there in the little <laughs> bubble submarine shit. They go down in fucking pitch black darkness of the ocean. Just keep sinking Will down. Smith's also. in it with him. Like he's in the trooper. bubble. He he's does in it. it. Oh, First shit. of all, bro, I didn't even know the little fucking shit that goes on down there. He had a red shirt on. The red shirt immediately turned like blue, all blue or like white or something. Yeah, like, once, you, once you get you the, lose it color. goes the spec like the, once you get, you know like you see like red is first on the spectrum then like yellow or whatever the deeper down you go the more those colors start to disappear because you, you lose can no longer color see that shit, wavelength bro. through the through the water it's crazy because color can't hit that far down like 
what the fuck? And then they went down there and they turned the big ass spotlights on on the submarine, right? And then she said, what, like, close your eyes and, and hold them for something? <laughs> no, didn't they say, like, close your eyes and then we turned the lights back on? I think so, yeah. It, it was like they turned the lights off, pitch black. And then close your eyes, close your eyes, turned them back on real quick. And then everything was lit up. Everything was bioluminescent shit. Like, oh, yeah. They shocked it with the light on the thing. It was oh, crazy. Yeah. Like, all, everything was what? just blue. Oh, my God. So it was crazy, though, because the point of the shit was like, we like he was saying like it looks empty down here it looks scary this that but then it happened and then he was like but we're really surrounded by life like it was just tons of little blue squiggly worms moving around them down there and shit thousands of a million you ever seen that like where people like in the ocean they're like yeah the bioluminescent water yeah and it just goes like the light blue. Blue. yeah bro i'll be like that, okay that's that cool let's go back up. like imagine <laughs> jumping in that truck, truck said okay i'd be like okay that's cool let's go back up let's go back up. <laughs> well, that, that, cool. same, that, that same that same they had done? another person I'm in a, a glass or plexiglass fire whatever clear canoe on the ocean at night where the entire top was covered in that bioluminescent. But that's like stuff. some straight up avatar so shit. It really was. They're just looking through the bottom of their glass canoe, it's just all seeing all lights. lights everywhere. I was like, bro, that's beautiful, but nah. nah I'm cool. I would be laying in the bottom of that canoe on the canoe shore canoe yeah, with, with terror. Bro, saltwater salt water crocodiles are what's scary, fucking, bro. Me, me in the parking lot. Looks cool. <laughs> <laughs> Way up on the beach, like, bro. Yeah. <laughs> looks cool. Like, yeah. cool. Yeah, nice cool, guys. Man. Hell yeah! All right, bro, salt water crocodile. Right here, Way Way scary, bro. Y'all yeah. ever been to St. Paul? Jumped yes. off the cliffs. Yes. Yeah. Isn't that where I jumped yes. off the eighty foot cliff? Yeah. 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 No. Bro. No. No. That's not no, that St. Paul. Paul. That was no, a quarry. St. Paul's. Yeah, like I went 30. to a quarry. That's, that's right. a quarry at St. Paul, bro. No, yeah, no. I'm pretty sure. I don't think it was. That was bro, it's way be. bigger than St. Paul. When was you it? jumped off, yeah. Where is St. Paul? What St. Paul's only like I think it's like thirty feet the biggest. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, the no. When I went off was literally 80. like eighty, maybe a hundred feet. Dude. It was insane. You could like break something. Dude, There's whatever a video he of it jumped off on was Facebook, high but I no fuck, longer bro. can find it. I mean, it was bigger than any diving platform I've ever Did seen. It hurt? Like, Did it hurt pool. when you hit the water? Oh yeah, I because I. I hit with my arms out because like, oh, I was flailing. So you didn't yeah. even know if there was Messed my wood shoulder or up for like rocks or nothing. Or rocks. There could have oh, been shit. a freshwater alligator swimming in there that someone released. You never know. Uh uh-uh. uh. No. <laughs> you know. Dude, the Speaking of gators and shit, is crazy. Tell me, bro. fucking oh, yeah, uh, fucked my shoulder. Up tell me, saltwater months. crocodiles like the ones in Africa and shit that when the wildebeest try to do the crossing and shit, you know, you've seen that shit before. Those oh, crocodiles. Man. What the fuck is that? Bro, and how the fuck did that dinosaur, dinosaur. get left some bad motherfuckers. Just stay? Bro, it's just crazy, man. Bro, it's just a ch- big lizard. That's all it is. Nah, that's way more than just a big crazy, ass lizard, bro. Ancient fucking. It's like saying the reptilian overlord. The saber tooth tigers are fucking. Where'd that shit go, bro? Why ain't they free Joe? It's in the permafrost, bro. boy. Free Joe Exotic. Why you know they, they really got exotic. fucking saber tooth skulls and shit. Saber tooth tiger king. <laughs> Bro, Al- Wait, uh, that's an animated show right there. A prehistoric Tiger King. You saber tooth Tiger King. <laughs> uh, in Greenfield, in Greenfield, close to somewhere I used to live, there's a little lake on this dude's property. And the, like, there's a rumor that like, uh, way back in the day, they found a woolly mammoth. To fucking see, that's uh, really not crazy. that surprising though, bro. Because like the fucking, they are like uh, finding pond. woolly man. Bro, have you seen the dude on fucking Joe Rogan? He lives in Alaska, owns property. They are like gold miners or whatever. And they started spraying this wall, this big, think of it as like a big ass dirt wall, right? Right there. And they start spraying the side of it with water. And every day, hundreds of bones just started falling out of this one pit. They call it a boneyard in Alaska. Did you see that shit? No, but that's crazy. And hold on though, the bones... 20,000 years old. What? 40,000 years old. They're, Bones from what, though? Bones day, no, from what? Mammoths. He's, saber tooth. Uh, his property is like a mammoth dinosaur, all sorts of shit. Great. Right. 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 So no, now no, they're no, wondering, like, how the fuck did all these all animals shit. die in one spot? Yeah, it's like a mass grave how? of multiple different And this species. is a real thing. This dude, this really happened. Like, and this from dude multiple really... different time periods and shit. Like, yeah. he says, like, 20,000 years 20, old. 40,000. That's, uh, 40, that's 40, some time travel and shit, You gotta show me that. I gotta watch it. Swear to God, bro. It's called The Boneyard. There's a documentary about the it. Boneyard. It's insane. I've it's never insane. seen no shit like that in my life. That's Ever. Crazy. And you can see them do it on film. They're they're shooting the fucking thing, shooting the water at it, and you can just see bones popping out. So question, question crazy. for everybody. Yeah. If you could 
time travel for two years and then you come back to present time, are you going 20 years in the past or 20 years in the future? Well, we only going to be on the iPhone 16? Not sure. 20 years. Oh, let's say 200. 200 years in the past or 200 future. years in the future? Future. 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 Do you want? Do you want two hundred years? The bro, craziest wait. technology and the ability what, to live forever. Why or do you, you want to go back and get the bubonic plague? What'd you say though? <laughs> yeah, bro. You say you could go back anywhere though. You don't have to pick the bubonic plague. No, he's yeah. saying, would you rather go back two hundred years or go forward two hundred years? That was just, by the that's end. That's it? where the question got. Two hundred years backwards or two hundred years. Forward? But you could go two hundred. I guess you could go anywhere. Let's say anywhere. You can go anywhere back in time if you got a specific moment. Nineteen eighty four. Would you go future 84. or past? Bro, I'd go past just me because I, I've always wanted to see like the era of like the black and white film and shit. I don't know, like forties, fifties. Yes, bro. I, I don't know. I've always wanted to see like the diner area era, like the breakthrough of color TV. Yeah, type, type shit. Like, shit. I don't know. Fucking the yes. Wizard of Oz, the old original one, got me on that, bro. I've always wanted to With see how they shot like old crazy movies. Like that was the first movie ever in color. That's crazy, bro. I think they colored like when, it after back when they a milkman yeah. delivered to your door. Yeah. Type colored shit. it after like that. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Crazy, bro. And it's like a physical fucking. How like, far, bro? Me, yeah. me, and him watch this shit called Corridor Crew on YouTube. Have you seen that? Uh, uh, VFX artist react. I was just oh, telling yeah, about that right, right, before yeah. we started shooting. Bro, the shit. How far it's came nowadays? Like virtual reality video games and shit. Bro, it's another level. I would definitely go to the past just to feel, I don't know, like before just cameras and cell phones and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Or like Broadway, New York in the 40s. Shoo. Yeah. Come on, bro. That would be, That'd so, be cool. so gas. Just yeah. to see. Just the but old the future cars would and also everything. be really cool, too. Yeah, the future would be super cool to oh, see yeah, how the far technology be, really went. See you know if there's I mean? like flying cars and yeah. shit like that. I don't think Elon Musk tunnels are going to get long enough, dog. Nah. Bro, Elon Musk tunnels, where did that shit go? Oh, that shit was going on. Oh, that shit's like in Cali and Vegas. It's really real. They done dug the tunnels. But you can yeah. really go through them? The cars go like 220 miles an hour through there. What? What cars? The it's magnetic all, plated. All Teslas. Like, Tesla. you, basically you, the Tesla. It'll take up, you somewhere. They're on like a pulley. And it and takes they just you to the end of the tunnel, and then you shoot. get the next one. Those just, things off movies, even, bro. Not even on a pulley. They're just self magnetic. Teslas, so it's they probably just, just so it's straight. magnetic, I thought. Or oh, something. I, I thought it was. Well, maybe it, he's upgraded it. I know when he first opened it, it was just, it was kind of underwhelming because it was just Teslas in the tunnel. That yeah. just drove you through, and it, they didn't even go that fast. I've seen like, something that was like 200 miles an hour, and you don't feel it. It's got this, say, like, bro. Uh, that might be fucking China. That just reminded me of, shit. have you seen, like, bro. a Tesla? I can't remember what Tesla it was, but driving on that ice lake, uh, and it stopping, coming to oh, a complete yeah, stop. Yeah, sure. the That's race. insane, bro. On an ice lake. Bro, they were driving on, like, a fucking frozen lake. Like you can't lake. slide in a Tesla, Dan. And, and the Tesla wouldn't slide on the ice. Really? Yeah, I was like, what the... F what bro. is this? Sorcery. How do you even do that? How do you do that? Magnetic shifts of the car. Yeah, bro. He's got like magnet. Like think of like a sliding gimbal Neuralink. with weights. Cars got Neuralink built yeah, into it. Bro, that Neuralink Probably shit. Real Musk the Cybertruck. You seen the dude that the made a song in his Tesla Cybertruck? Yes, bro. You could do so much shit. And it's got a. It's Tesla. got a built-in doll. Did you audio? Dude, works, the, the fucking the Elon insane. doll, bro. And the there, Elon cook doll. Up. Imagine bro. cooking on the Elon doll, bro. Cooking that's, up straight that from sounds scratch. Like fire. The cyber Tesla beats, bro. The cyber beats, bro. That is really insane. That would be crazy. I bet the audio system is crazy, bro. Bro. The microphone cans on like your head while you're driving. Bro, am I the, the only on one the that's not really a fan of the fucking rectangle steering wheel? Though? I don't like that shit. That shit gives me anxiety. It's like a Formula yeah, One steering wheel. Like, it's, it's like Joe Rogan said. This, I like to bro, like, ride like this or like hold the bottom of the steering wheel. Yeah, like having gotta, to hold the sides is annoying. Hot, yeah. Fuck that. Yeah, no, whole, you're his right. Whole thing, yeah. His whole thing was like, well, Formula One cars are like that. Fuck, I'm not a Formula this One This ain't driver. no Formula One car. Dude, that video of Elon coming out on stage with the Cybertruck and he's like, the windows are fucking super bulletproof, and then somebody hits it with a bat and it shatters the first time. It's like, yo, whoa, dude. Hey, at least he like sure. owned up to it, and he wasn't like, oh, yeah, no, uh, he's like, uh, you know, know what? Like, We're gonna no, have to fix that. Have to fix it. I right. really, I don't care. People can talk shit about Elon. I don't know if it's just people online. You know what I mean? Oh, like, dude, he's the goat. He's he's the goat, he's the bro. Goat, bro. But I'd he's rather him. Goat. I feel like he's Elon, doing, he's a yeah, he's a billionaire, Twitter. but he's like not. I feel like Jeff Bezos is more fucked up than Elon Musk. You know what I mean? Like. Elon Musk is doing some crazy shit. He's really trying to. Was he on the uh, Epstein list? 
Bro, probably on the Epstein list. I don't. Did it ever actually fully get released? I don't no. think it did. I don't think it. Bro, somebody could See, literally. I mean, there's no way it ever. But hold on, no. Think, so about like this, right? think, think about, about it like this, though. Think about it like this. It's the real. Think one. about it like that's what I'm right. saying. Think about it like this, bro. There was such a hype around that shit. Bro, what? <laughs> what the? Are you a cat, dude? I there thought, was. No, listen. There was so much uh-huh. hype around the Epstein list and all this shit. Tell me, one of us couldn't have made some crazy shit on our phones or something, right? Yeah. Posted it bro. and it went viral on Instagram yeah, or shit. Facebook or something. You know what I mean? A like, list, yeah. Yeah. Like you could have just made the What's list. What's the real list? That's what I want to know. Yeah, but like, why? Like, I don't know. You don't think they didn't keep they did nobody? Bro, it's like, ain't it always just some straight up weird ass shit on the West Coast, bro? The diddler didn't kill himself. I'm waiting for P Diddy to hang himself. In That's what I was going to say that earlier. Well, they was, said he's in down. a country you can't All get right, What did you say? I didn't mean to interrupt you. He's what Tupac. You he's the next Tupac. What what happened to Diddy? I don't know, man. He probably died. Dude, he was spotted in Miami last night. He spotted it there. I'm telling he you. spotted at Meek Mill's house. <laughs> right, he's in Antigua. Bro, what were they he's saying Meek about Mill. Meek <laughs> What were they saying about Meek Mill? What did Meek Mill have to do with it? They, they fucked. just they're that saying he, that like he like it's I mean it's pretty him. so there's some sus lyrics and I don't know there's just he got his black butt. Twitter is all over Meek butt. Mill. They're, they're trying to come. What'd from, you say? Trying he to come from home too. He got his what? He got his butt. Did he got Meek? He butt. snatched that ass. <laughs> Damn, dude, he's a fucking. He's I mean, there's that video of that calling him daddy while he's in the pool. His, like, he snatched his stink star. <laughs> counted the, his pickles count the his on your stink, stink star. star. I, said, I said chocolate starfish, bro. Remember <laughs> that, bro? Stole his chili ring. His chili ring. Uh, chili yeah. ring is crazy, I love chili bro. ring. Popped his and then Meek Mill hit Twitter. He was like, "I love pussy, dude. I put, I like pussy so much, dude. That's <laughs> so cool, dude. That was the no, most middle. Did. Yes, bro. We got no, to he pull did. up the tweet. So, uh, no, he I did. I fucking not, love bro. pussy, dude. Read I will the tweet. Read the tweet. It's pussy, over. Girl, yeah. Wait, it all Meek feels Mill. so fucking great, dude. It feels Meek so Mill great. Meek Mill ran the X and made a post. <laughs> yeah, bro. He was like, Elon, <laughs> help me. It was he so he weird. fucking ran to, bro, to X so and made funny. a tweet. Bro, it's so funny. <laughs> I'm fucking up. When I got when I got a girl around me, I'm fucking her twice a day. LOL. Ask some of your favorites. Pussy, <laughs> pussy don't control me, but it's like a high. Hold on, stop, 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 stop. You gotta Yo. do it in like a Philly Meek Mill accent though. Here, you gotta. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> you want me to do a Philly accent or a Meek Mill accent? When I got a girl around me, I'm far. I, that was Canadian. I can't do a Philly accent. I'm not. When that I got a trash. girl around me, but he said, "When I got a girl around me, I'm fucking her twice a day." LOL. Ask some of your favorites. Dot dot dot. Pussy don't control me, but it's like a high. Dot dot dot. One love to the gay people, but that juicy pussy do it for me with seven E's and a teeth showing smiley face. Bro, Bro. I done ran red lights to get that feeling. Y'all weird on here like devils. Yeah. LOL. Bro, no pussy. way. I fuck pussy so much. Bro, I'm so straight, bro. I'm so straight. Bro. I'm so straight, bro. bro. I'm so, so straight. straight. I chase pussy. Meek Mill's boof. It's that online. sweet, juicy pussy for me. <laughs> That's what does it. <laughs> bro, Meek Mill keep getting arrested for popping wheelies. <laughs> 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 every who gets, who every does time that? he's in prison, he's in there for fucking reckless I'm driving. I'm just <laughs> waiting on Diddy to come just get a me. A bunch of reckless driving charges. Bro. Jesus oh, Christ, man. bro! Shout out to Meek though. Free jail, free. <laughs> bro. bro, they got a fucking documentary out now called uh, Freak Nick. You know what the Freak Nick is, right? Mm-mm. The big ass meetup. The fucking. In the hood where the Big ass meetup That sounds crazy Where they would They all like partied and shit And I guess it got fucking crazy It turned into fucking Like <laughs> an orgy Bohemian <laughs> That's where I'm going Like what Yo Orgy Jam They were Yo so They were popping their pussy What's it called and, and uh, On 24s Bro <laughs> on tw- on 24s. How does that even shit. start Like you come back from the kitchen You're like I got everybody j- Whoa dude What are you guys <laughs> doing Oh man dude I got the s- uh, samosas. <laughs> <laughs> I brought everybody a beer. They're all at a freak nick. Yeah. Bro, you walk in, you're late to the party. You're like, it was all like outside in the middle of the road and shit. Wow. Cars. Oh my God. Chicks just fucking completely naked. Yeah, it's like, who's that in the driveway? Oh, shit. I forgot. Told grandma we needed butter. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Yo, dude, world is so fucked up. <laughs> Bro, a freak Nick is wild. You think fucking uh, the Boy Scouts of America? Nick. Wait, what? He said a meek Nick. A you meek the, Nick? You think the Boy Scouts of America is just like a tiny little Bohemian Grove? <laughs> like, I mean, they it's do like, go hold out on, hold on. the forest. It's like, it's like little fucking chapters of a biker gang. <laughs> These people are demons. <laughs> They got little fucking nomad fucking bohemian girls running little around. Little children demons, the Boy Scouts of America. They, they're reptilians. That's his Alex Jones. See, uh, my, it's my uh, dry throat, cannabis. Alex Jones. I can't do uh, it. Have you ever seen the movie Kid Cannabis? Uh-uh. It's like this uh, This kid lives in like uh, Michigan or something, and he's like driving. He goes into Canada and buys a pound of weed and puts it in his book bag and then just walks across the border and brings it home and sells it. So he keeps on doing it. It's like the Canadian version of fucking yeah, it's an episode Richard of Trailer Park Drive. Boys, right? Right. But that's what I'm saying, bro. That's what we should start doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah, just start thugging it and yeah. saying fuck it. Smuggling yeah. weed through Canada. Make well, sure you heard it here first, guys. We yeah. make a documentary called Get Rich or Die Trying. <laughs> <Yo. laughs> oh my God, dude. Hey, 50 Cent. Shout out 50 Cent for hanging t- It's a funny ass movie. Though. Hanging tough. You said funny ass movie? Yeah. What was funny about him fucking getting capped up nine times? In the face. I was talking about the kid can't do it. <laughs> Get Rich or Die Trying. Right. Listen, listen, no, it's because I'm. I mean, I see him as more of a. Dude, more, what was your favorite it's fucking, satire? What was your favorite gangster movie? My favorite gangster movie is Walk Hard, Dewey Cox. <laughs> what about you? Walk the Line, Johnny Cash. Walk the Line, favorite gangster movie? <laughs> you, know. gangster movies? I don't know. What's your favorite gangster movie? <laughs> I mean, just like so many of them. I mean, I've just seen so many. I, I don't Don't I be a menace to society. I oh, I mean, if you're going to count that, that's the best parody gangster movie of all time. No, that's Don't Be a Menace to South Central while oh, drinking yeah, no. your juice so in the So you're hood. talking menace to society. That's the real version. Yeah, no, that's menace to society. Don't be a menace. It's not Don't Be a Menace <laughs> to Society. Is it? Yeah, it's Don't Be a Menace. What is it? Don't Be a Menace in Dennis South or and don't be a menace to South Central while drinking Drink juice in the hood. hood. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But the but other there's, movie, there's, there's a menace to, so, menace to society. Menace there's, to society. Yeah, yeah. Where do you come up with yeah, that yeah, name? Exactly. Boys to menace of society. <laughs> <laughs> Boys to menace no, of society. Yeah, I mean, I love don't be a menace. But Mine's broke back mountain for sure. Never seen menace to society. <laughs> yeah, fire. That's pretty good one. Because I'm broke back mountain is one of the most gangster movies. Dude, that never seen that one. I haven't masturbated to that movie several Broke times. Mountain. I know who has. <laughs> Julio Jake. Did I already ask you what the fucking problem with Julio Jake not being able to get hard to any porn at all is? What is it? What has he got? The fact that he was hard. What, is that what he said? You guys Did he naked? say that? Bro, he said he cannot get hard to any porn ever. Sponsored by Blue Chew. <laughs> yeah, Blue Chew is crazy. That's gay, dude. Uh, yeah, kind of what I'm thinking. Right? It's kind of just gay. What do you think he? What do you think he watches? You think he just watches Broke everything? Back mountain, bro. Uh, how do you not get hard? Broke that him? scat pack. He, he watches like <laughs> World War II educational videos to jerk <laughs> off, dude. That's, that's like, the only so way I can get World War II in color. Mm-hmm. That's the only way I feel alive. Yeah, the the remastered footage where they <laughs> they went back the and remastered World, World, World War II footage. <laughs> Jacking off the World War II in color is crazy. <laughs> do you pop on Netflix and you bust one to World War II in color? Is <laughs> so like, oh, I'm nuts. about to get shell shocked. Fucking <laughs> true crime podcasts. You get fucking real life shell shock. Oh,